Okay, bye! <laughs> <laughs> I want to kill myself right now. Teresa, you Hi, this is Jessica, and this is the other Jessica, and this is Teresa, and this is our haul video. And Teresa, did you want to start? Stupid nail clippers, you want to Okay. Who wants to say so. it? So. <laughs> okay, Teresa, I guess she's holding it. Okay. So, over the past couple of weeks, we've gotten a lot of products. Um, first thing is the fitness. <laughs> so, this product is quite highly raved amongst a lot of Korean beauty gurus on YouTube, I guess. This is the product. <laughs> this is the baby one. Yep. I agree at this. So basically the texture is a balmy, you know, so it's balmy, but when you start putting it on, it becomes oily and basically just it's melts a cleansing it oil, off. bro. Okay, I get it, you don't have to roast me like that. <laughs> so all these products from Vanilla Crow are actually part of a kit that was for $58 at W Cosmetics. And it came with a mirror, eye patch, an eye patch, a mask, a sleeping mask, the um, a sample pack version of the Clinic Zero and what else was it? A powder primer, a yes. cushion. It's a CC cushion case. So it yep. Was, it's interesting. There's the the pad for it. <coughs> this is the refill, right? Yep. The There's refill. two refills in there. There's two refills. In there. Yeah. That's it. <laughs> so we placed an order of ColourPop. Made in LA. <laughs> it's really pretty on the inside. Yeah, and they always give you a card, and it's so cute. So this is the Alexis Ren Color um, X Color Pot Contour Palette, and it comes with a contour and a highlight. I'll just go like this. Hold the mirror. Oh yeah. <clears throat> and this is the highlighter trio. Um, in waffle, so it comes with three highlighters, scrumptious, glaze, and flexitarian. It was around twenty dollars, so it's actually a pretty good deal. Oh, are they highlighters? Yeah. yeah. Why don't I get that? So these are the three colors. And we've got a few shadows. One comes in a bundle called Peachy King with a metallic shadow and three matte shadows. So they've also got three lip products, so two of them are the Ultra Matte Lips and they're in Lumia 2 and Solo. Lumia is also cutting like... Yeah. What do you know everything? I watch her. <laughs> She's pretty. And then the Ultra Satin Lip, which is in the colour Echo Park, which I'm wearing now. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> So Colourpop was having a deal where you buy two Super Shop eyeshadows and you get a free eyeshadow brush. So the two that Jessica got. What's the colour? It's on the outside. I mean on the it's inside. On the inside. So this um this one should be Porter, which is a nice purple colour. Oh my god, that's a nice swatch it. Oh my god, what the <laughs> It's like a nice thick burgundy purple. Matching your shirt. Yeah. Uh, so this is Sika and it's it's kind of like a maroon brown, so the swatch would be like this. They're so pigmented. Yeah, it's really nice. So we're lucky enough to have Early Picker, which is a online Korean beauty shop which sells the hottest and trendiest makeup. So they were able to contact us and send us a couple of products. The um, shipping was actually pretty fast. It got here in around two weeks. Two weeks, yeah. which is from Korea to Sydney, which usually takes like. A month, one month or so. So the shipping's really fast, and the service is really nice. The communication's really good. So we chose two items each, and we had two left over, and we just chose it together. So I chose the Vanilla Co Clean at Zero, and the Too Cool for School Art Class by Rodin, the bronzer. So it's this one, and it's just a really nice like trio. So you can choose whichever colour you want to use more. And I got two products from Aquasin because I've been really wanting to try out their products and they're quite expensive here in Sydney so it's really nice to try them out. And the first one is like the really really hyped up um, 
Aqua Skin Magic Stone Costume, and I've got it in shade 23, which is the, the darkest shade they have. It comes like this. And then we have And also, I got the Aqua Skin No Smudge Eye Doll Brush Pen Liner in black. Because I've heard a lot of reviews about this and it's really good. It's similar to the Clio or Kill eyeliner. So, so no. No, you also got the 4D Diet Bronzer Stick and the Chateau La Biote. <laughs> Why <Wine. laughs> Why did it? And what color is this? This is shade Milo Burgundy. Which is, I think, I'm guessing a burgundy color. Yeah, three. Mm -hmm. Some three, right? Yeah, some three. Yep, and I chose the Royal Honey Propolis Essence by Skin Food, and it comes in a dropper bottle. And I also got the Medicube Red Serum. And Medicube was what? I think quite popular, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So it's been on our Facebook, so I want to try it out. And these two stones, I heard that was really good for cleansing the magic stones, so I got both of them. And so for early picker, they often provide cosmetics at the lowest price, and they also have time sales, so you have you can get bundles for really cheap, and they also have a sample pack. So again, we were lucky enough to get contacted by Fellas Cosmetics, which is a vegan and cruelty-free um, cosmetics company. They sell brushes, they sell cosmetics, just shadows, shadow eyeshadows. Yeah. Okay. So they sell brushes and eyeshadows. We got the 20 brush kit. It comes with a lot of brushes. <laughs> yeah, and these brushes are vegan and cruelty free, so that means the fur is not real. <laughs> so it's palace. Not tested on animals then? Yeah. yeah. So this is the 20 brushes that we got. It comes in a kit. The brushes are really soft. Yeah. And they're so good quality. So we also got three loose shadow pigments in the colours Oppress, Assorted and Humiliate and they're so pretty. Like the packaging. Look at the packaging. Are they separate? Let this try. No they're not. Damn it. Oh my god this one's holographic. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah they're all holographic. It's beautiful. So oh my god these are holographic. That's so cool. Oh so Oppress is a pink shimmery shade, it has like silver sparkles in it and it's so pigmented. So this is sorted and it's based, it's a like kind of iridescent whitish color. It has like, like holographic. It's like holographic and like zero chrome. And so, it's so really nice. when you open it, it's not what it seems on the bottom that it shows you, it's actually a brownish color. We're not gonna open these because But once you like, like put it on, when it catches the light, It'll look different in every like perspective. Yeah. So Yep, yeah, and this is Humiliate and the name is just right there. So um it's a charcoaly brown colour and just like the other one it's a loose pigment which changes colours depending on the light that's reflecting on it and yeah. yeah so all these other products we kinda of just got like different shops online or in store depending so it's more like a collective so i've been really interested to try this silly sponge out so i got one on ebay for like a dollar which is not the real one but um if it, i mean i'm guessing the materials well Super. i mean they all do the same thing so just they're all silicon <laughs> why spend like 14 dollars yeah that's a lot of money yeah so i got this and i'm gonna try it it's out perfect. Apparently, I don't know, there's a lot of mixed reviews on this, but I'm going to see if it works for uh, I got a couple of things off Beauty Net Korea. So, the first thing was the Semu, 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 um, Perfect Pore Pact. And it's similar, I think it's quite similar to the Innisfree No Pore Sebum Pact. Pore, Pore Pact. Mm -hmm. yeah. So it's just white. Right. And it's translucent. I actually tried this and it's quite, it's really smooth. It just kind of melts into your skin. Which is really nice. So that. Got two eyebrow pencils. This is the Wonder Drawing 24 Hour Auto Eyebrow Eyebrow by Holica Holica in dark brown and the Tony Morley Auto Eyebrow. And I think this is also dark brown. Yeah. And I also got the Velvet Skin Primer. I haven't tried this, but 
after opening and smelling it kind of smells like the elf green primer i'm not sure what it's called it's but oh no at Amazon Frame Shop there was a sale going on where eyeshadows were 25% off so I went in and had a look and I got two items one was an eyeshadow and one was an eyeliner and the eyeliner is the Catch Me Eyeliner from Lovely Me X in the shade 02 which is a brown and I also got a maroonish burgundy eyeshadow colour I'm not sure what the number is but yeah. And from Tony Moly, I got the two sh um, I got two sh eyeshadows, both matte. So one is a beige and another is a peachy color. So I got a couple of things off um, this shop. Hi Beauty Eye. Yeah, I buy Beauty. So the first one is the um, Drawing Eyebrow by Etchit House. And this is in grey brown, I think. Hopefully. I think it's quite it's difficult to tell the color because it's all in Korean. Uh, I also got which I've been really needing to try for a really long time. This is the um, tint my brow by Edgy House, which is the brow tint that everyone's been trying. Yeah, and this is in grey brown too. Uh, and the last eyebrow product I got from Edgy House was the color my brows eyebrow mascara, and this is in dark brown. And one thing that isn't eyebrow related that I got from Eye by Beauty is this is the Perfect Perfection Ideal Concealer Duo, but it's the same. And I have the um, the normal one, which is like the tiny one with the J-Foot applicator, and this is just another version, but instead it has um, a stick concealer. Okay, so I popped into Target and I um, I picked up these two things from e.l.f. So this is a makeup remover pen and Jess actually recommend <laughs> 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 uh, recommended. I recommended it to you. Yeah, too. Jess actually recommended yeah. this to me because she always uses it and I always see her use it. So you just, um, if you mess up your eyeliner or something, you just use it to take it off and it works really, really well. And this is just a baked blush. Similar to the highlighter one. Yeah, similar to the baked highlighter. Highlighters. And it's just really pretty. And it was really cheap as well, so that's what it looks like. I mm. think you have to also try and get the first layer off. Yeah, for I've heard. Sunshine. I've heard a lot of people talk about like scraping the first layer off because I don't know, just the way they make it. Something like the first layer, it doesn't show enough pigment, and it's not. I think that they do an overspray of like yeah. glitter or something. Maybe. Just do. So the last So the last couple of things is these two eyeliners from Eclipse and I just got them in brown and black. So the simple everyday colours. <laughs> right, how many eyeliners and eyebrow things do you need? <laughs> <I know. laughs> like literally like, literally came out like what is going on? Okay, last thing. And so from Innisfree, I got the skinny mascara, so with the one is really small. And I got it in waterproof and just long on Cara. I really liked it when I first tried it because my lashes are kind of short and it really just extends it. And from Nature Republic, I got the Aloe Soothing Gel, which is really good for, it's kind of similar to a body butter but in gel form. So yeah. It's really natural too. 92% aloe vera. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, it's really good. I have that actually. Yeah, yeah I have it. Did you get it from um, W Cosmetics? Yeah. But it's in a different packaging. It's like a fat um, like, uh, Oh, so it's, it's like, like the, the aloe, aloe, the aloe. No, 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 it's like longer tub. Oh, it's it's the same thing. There's long tubs? Yeah, but like smaller. Okay, whatever. That's enough of that. So that's yeah. the end. Okay. So that's the end of our haul. And if you guys want to see some reviews on all these products that we've gotten, go, make sure to go check out our blog, which is going to be linked down below. Um, it's just BTIA. 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 Yeah, BTIA. Yeah, BTIA. <laughs> <laughs> and um, make sure to um, like and comment on this video. If you enjoyed it. If you enjoyed it and subscribe because we're starting to build a channel basically. Yeah, yeah. so after doing a couple of blog posts, we wanted to resurface our, how do you say, 
our passion for our makeup. Our passion <laughs> for makeup onto the internet for you guys. So yeah. Yeah, that was fun. <laughs>